Hi, my name is Saad Ibrahim uh, with Petro Management Group. I am the instructor of the class Well Test Analysis for Non-Specialists. Uh, well Test Analysis uh, is considered one of the most effective reservoir management tool. Uh, it is used for well production optimization. It's used for reservoir characterization. Uh, it has tremendous applications for reservoir management. Now, many of the engineers, uh, they like to use that tool, but uh, they are reluctant to go through uh, the rigorous process of how to analyze the test, uh, obviously to attend a very extensive uh, training session, like for a week or so. So we designed this, this course uh, just for one day to give you a very brief, uh, high-level overview of the world test interpretation techniques. Uh, with this course, you'll be able to uh, understand the process of well test analysis, not necessarily how to do it yourself, but basically if you have uh, one of your specialists doing the analysis or you hire a consultant, you'll be able to edit the report and extract the information that you need to make your own decisions uh, for reservoir management. So the class starts with a brief description of the process of wall testing, what goes out in the field in terms of equipment, uh, the pressure gauges, how to run recorder downhole to measure the pressure while testing the well, uh, and also how to test a well uh, using other tools like acoustic well sounder, uh, if you can't run a recorder when you're pumping the well, or maybe use the Y tool, it's a, y, uh, it's a bypass to allow you to run recorder below the pump. And then uh, the course goes on uh, to take you into the, uh, a bit of technical background about well test interpretation. So we go through uh, the fundamentals such as the flow geometry, uh, depends how you complete the well. Uh, you could have radial flow, or bilinear flow, or spherical flow. So it goes through that uh, description of each flow geometry and what technique is used to analyze the test for different completion techniques. Also, we cover the concept of reservoir boundaries, like uh, when the well is uh, not stabilized yet, so it's in transient, or when the well goes into stabilization, when you reach to the steady state, or when the well uh, is producing from uh, oil or gas zone uh, with an aquifer that is maintaining the pressure, and that's what we call steady state. Then we go through the actual process of interpretation, and the first stage is the data quality. So we go through the, the steps where you check the quality of all the data received from the field, whether it's pressure data, production data, fluid analysis. And then we go through the process of flow regime diagnosis, so we know what flow regime we're dealing with. And then the actual step-by-step -step, uh, to analyze the test from uh, looking at the uh, diagnostic tools like the pressure derivative plots, um, and also uh, the use of the standard Horner plot and the derivative to analyze the test uh, to extract uh, information like reservoir pressure, permeability, uh, skin factor, uh, if the well is damaged or uh, stimulated. And finally, uh, we show the history matching of your test data. After that, once you have a credible model in your uh, software, we show how to do some production forecasting and different sensitivity analysis. Um, the last section in the class, we talk about uh, the requirement by the board, uh, the AER, in terms of uh, well testing and the submission requirement. So we go through guide 40, uh, which is set by the board uh, to give the oil companies what to do, what kind of test, and the data requirement to satisfy the board. So that's a brief of uh, the well test analysis for non-specialists. Uh, of course, if you'd like to know more about well testing, we have a full four-day class on the actual well test uh, interpretation where we show the software and the variety of applications. Thank you for listening uh, to this brief.